here at GL Veneer, we have a 12,000 board foot kiln that we dry our slabs in. We can stuff the slabs in here up to about nine feet tall and 25 feet wide, 12 feet deep, getting 12,000 board feet of drying capacity in here. So loading the wood in the kiln is always a fun exercise. It's kind of like a Tetris game. It really makes us scratch our heads sometimes because these slabs are not dimensional lumber. They're not square edge. They're all different sizes, large, small. So we're really looking at the best way to fit the slabs in equally so that the airflow is consistent throughout the load. So one thing that differentiates us in our process is we put RF probes, radio frequency probes, inside the wood a quarter inch deep and half inch to an inch deep. What this does is shows us the water moving inside the wood. So we have a, a control panel at our computers and we can know exactly what the wood is doing at all times. So when you buy a kiln dried slab from us, what you're gonna get is a, a slab with moisture content from 10 to 12%, as opposed to an air dried slab, which might have anywhere from 20 to 30% moisture content. If you don't have a kiln dried slab, what happens is that moisture releases over time, it cracks, splits, and bends the wood. What we're doing in this process is forcing that moisture to come out in a slow and conservative way so that the wood is a usable, workable product. So slabs are already an expensive product. If you're gonna invest your time, energy, and money in something, make sure that it's a kiln-dried product. 